Hiya, are you alright? Just got back, I've been on my holidays, but isn't it good to get back? It's good to see you, Duchess. But yeah, we're back now. Back on track, I've put £2 on. Not impressed with that since I didn't have any crisps. Well, I had one bag of crisps and one pudding in a week. I don't think that's bad. And I walked and I swam. Maybe £2, not so bad. It's not the end of the world, is it? We'll soon get it off. So I'm going to make a quiche, some little quiches, because I'm starving and I want something to eat. But I'm going to make them with some phyllo pastry. Psh, psh, phyllo pastry. Um, it's got less calories than short crust pastry. So just I'm going to use 100 grams of phyllo pastry. Just bought. There's not a chance on this earth that I'm going to start making phyllo pastry. Just buy some. So there it is. And I've got... Um, it's quite a big muffin tray, I would say. It's bigger than cupcake size. Although the size doesn't matter. Cut your pastry into six pieces. Equal if you can. I'm going to need... That's better. I need two hands for doing this. Wait, I'll put a light on. Just feels a bit dark. So I've cut it into six pieces. So I've gone along and I'll go this way. And it's only six pieces because this is six. You could make one big one, you could make four, but I'm making six. Now this is non-stick. If you haven't got anything that's not non-stick, um, just spray it with some spray oil. Line the inside, it doesn't have to be neat. It just has to be secure. I want no holes in the bottom and it has to come up the sides. I was just thinking doing this, the little mini ones would be nice if you were going on a picnic, wouldn't they? Because these can be cold or warm. There, I've done them all, see? Now you want six eggs and 100 mils of milk. Give it a good whisk together. I've defrosted a couple of handfuls of frozen peas. Just share them out between each one. Such a sign, can you hear it? I've already got a few too many there, but never mind. And I'm going to put some salmon in. I'm going to have pea and salmon. So I've put a bit of salmon between each one. This is a 120 gram pack. I don't think I'm going to use it all. This salmon's just from Aldi. You can see it's got dill on it. I thought that might be nice. I think I might use it all, you know. I have. I've used all of it. There, I've used it all. I've shared it out. Now share the egg mixture between all the cases. I've already done it, it didn't record. But then do this, give it a shake, just so that the egg mixture surrounds all your peas and your salmon. There we go, they look good, don't they? They're going in a 180 oven. I'm not sure how long for, I'll let you know. I've just had a look at them. They've had 20 minutes, I'm gonna give them five minutes more, but they're almost done. They look lovely, they've puffed up nicely. But yeah, I'm looking forward to one of those because I'm hungry. I think I've worked out how many calories are in them and it's about 174, which isn't bad because it's quite big. So I've just checked on them. They've been in the oven for 20 minutes. They've puffed up really nicely. I'm looking forward to one of those. I'm just going to give them another five minutes. So 25 minutes and that's them done. Um, I'm all tidied up. I've just done my third load of washing. I'm going to have a cup of tea when that comes out and eat one of those. I feel like I've never stopped. I do feel like I've had a busy August. I've had a few events on. Like I've been obviously a bit of Spain for my holidays for a week. I went to, I've got a wedding coming up this weekend. I've been to, out for my tea. What else have I done? I've had a couple of birthdays. I went to see Top Loader at the old fire station. Brilliant. Really good. I remember them from 20 years ago. They were fabulous. It was dead good. And I've booked another show. It's, I think Jenny Eclair. 5th of October, it's a Wednesday night, so I'll probably go straight from work. Um, but I'm looking forward to that because she's dead funny, isn't she? So why don't you pop along? I'll see you there. Say hello. But I think that'll be good. Um, 
So I'm looking forward to that. And there was a comedy night coming up as well. I might book tickets for that. That was quite soon. I'll have to have another look. I'll have a sit down and have a look. It's nice to have things in the diary though, isn't it? And it's a cracking little venue that. I'll pop a little link on. And if you fancy it, I'll see you there. Now in the time I've been waffling on to you, I reckon these little quiches will be ready. So let's go and have a look. nice there there I would say 25 minutes half an hour 180 I'm gonna let them cool a bit before I try and get them out of that tray because I've already burnt my finger getting them out of the oven so I'll give them five minutes right now these should just lift out look If you need to, just go around the edge with a knife if you need to loosen it off. How good do they look? How nice are they? Right, I'll cut one of these in half. I've got two knives. How full of filling they are. Don't need a fork. It's hot. Delicious. Lovely. Nice little afternoon snack. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you what would be nice. Mushroom and tomato, that'd be a nice breakfast one, wouldn't it? Lovely. Right, give these a go. Gorgeous, warm or cold. Put whatever fillings in that you like. Just make sure your egg mixture's right. 100 mils of milk to six eggs. And that'll ensure it's set. 20, 25 minutes in the oven. Perfect. Give these a go. If you have a go at making these, send us a picture. Let us know what fillings you put inside them. But they're lovely. I'll put the recipe on at the end so you can screenshot it and have a look. What I will say is, don't message me asking for um, temperatures. It's 180 in my oven. That's what Google's for. So if you want to know what it is in your oven, do the translation via Google. Because I don't know and I don't have time to look for you and to put it all on. But enjoy these. I'm going to finish this one off. I'm going to go and see if Ian wants one. But have a great day. I'll see you soon. Might see you at Jenny Eclair. Bye bye.